It's music time in Africa. Hi, I'm Heather Maxwell. Joining me today is an African jazz vocalist, Loida Georges. Welcome to Music Time in Africa, Loida. Thank you. It's a pleasure to have you here with your two guys. Who do you have with you? Absolutely. Well, first of all, thank you for having us. I've got Mungezi and Taka on guitar, mm -hmm. um, hailing all the way from South Africa by way of Washington, D.C. And I have Jordan Ringo on the upright bass, and he trekked all the way from West Virginia just for today. Wonderful. You're going to start right out with, I think, the title track to your new CD. Yes. In, In Time. time. Time brown turns to green again In time numb starts to feel In time broken turns to whole again In time broken starts to heal Da mi tempo pra restaurar Da mi tempo pra descansar Da mi tempo pra chorar Da mi tempo pra orar Enche o meu Deus com amor, dá-me uma solução. I start to breathe again, begin to restore. No choice but to love again, leave pain by the door. Dá-me tempo para restaurar. Dá-me tempo pra descansar Dá-me tempo pra chorar Dá-me tempo pra amar Minha saúde, minha alma Meu coração oh, 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 oh. Enche o oh, meu Deus com amor Dá-me uma solução Tempo pra restaurar starts to heal in time brown turns to whole again in time numb starts to feel da mi tempo pra restaurar da mi tempo pra descansar da mi tempo pra chorar da mi tempo pra amar Amor, 
green again in time in time thank you that's my favorite song on your new album thank you i really love it partly just the mix of portuguese and english um, so tell me about that song. Is this a love, a love gone bad, and you're recovering? What um, it sounds like to me. It it could be that. So this song was born out of a rough patch in my life, mm-hmm. between fresh out of my father and two of my aunts passing away, and a bad breakup. Oh. So yeah, that's a lot going that's a on. Lot. Yeah. <laughs> now it was over the course of a few years, but at the same time, pain builds and. Yeah. The idea of this song is taking the time to heal, using your time to heal, Mm -hmm. and that in time, you will be whole again. Again, the key is how we use it, but this song is about the gift and the beauty of time, whether you're healing from a broken heart or a Mm -hmm. lost loved one um, in time. So do you write all of your songs? I do. I do. Wow. Yeah. And you had one other album before, 2006, was it? Yes, two thousand. Actually, two thousand and eight. Two thousand and eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And those were all originals as well. No, that was a mix of a handful of originals, but also favorites of mine. I see. Um, so n- this is my first completely original project. Oh, I see. Yeah. yeah. Well, now, so tell me a little bit about your background. Okay. I know you are based in Washington D.C. Yes. But you are from a Lusophone African heritage. Your parents both. Absolutely. Mozambique. Well, tell me. Sure, sure. (laughs) My mother's from Mozambique, and my father is from Guinea-Bissau, two different corners of the continent, uh, but they met in Mozambique. Mm -hmm. Then they both traveled to France for school. That's where I was born. And then we came to America in the 80s, and I was raised here in America. Mm -hmm. So I am a true diasporian kid. In every sense of the word, every African. Sense of it. Yeah, really, you yeah. really are. Mm-hmm. Do you have brothers and sisters? I do have a younger sister. Is she musical as well? She loves to listen to music. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what about the rest of your parents? For example, were they musicians, or how did you get involved in in being a singer and songwriter? And- the church. That, oh, yeah. My mom, she does sing, but in church choirs mm-hmm. and. Um, Music was always part of what was happening at home. We always sang at home, Mm -hmm. mainly hymnals, but we were singing. And um, I grew up playing the piano, the ukulele, and the flute. Um, All of that I left a long time ago, so I don't even claim that I'm a... Ukuleleist? No, no. (laughs) I do not. But those are my Uh, beginning instruments. uh And I would have a little tape recorder. I'd write my little songs. I'd record them. Um, and that was since I was five or six years old. Mm-hmm. And so what church, we're talking like Baptist hymns, like the hymnal, like... Protestant hymns. Yeah. yeah. What's your favorite hymn? Um, Shall We Gather at the River. How's it go? Shall we gather at the river, the beautiful river of gold? <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. I love hymnals, actually. I, I like them. I like them. But I don't know that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, there's many. Then there's the Portuguese hymns. And yes. so, yeah. Do you speak Portuguese? I speak Portuguese. Yeah. I do. It sounds like it. I do. Uh, I, do. I, I recognize meu coração. Coração. Sim. My love, my heart, my right? heart, my love, my heart. Do your bandmates speak Portuguese? I don't know, Jordan. No. Do you speak Portuguese? I'm learning Spanish right now. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> He's learning Spanish. No, no, no. no, no, no. He's um, got his own languages. He's uh-huh. speaking. Yes. <laughs> so tell me, introduce us to your your bandmates. Would Absolutely. You? So Jordan Ringo is on the upright bass. Mm-hmm. I've known him for years, and he actually works a lot with Mongizi and Taka. I see. He's also a local musician, mm-hmm. and um, he's got a beautiful ear and a beautiful touch on the bass, mm-hmm. and I am happy to have him here with me today. Great. Yeah. What about the man, to gentleman to your left? Yes. Yeah, so Mongizi is not only um, a guitarist, but he is a composer, and he co-produced the album that I just released. I see. Yeah, so on that album, there are 10 originals, and he composed seven out of 10 of them. One of those songs, I definitely heard Mongezi's touch. I'm like, a South African is involved here. I could hear it on yeah. the piano and, and keyboard. Yeah, yeah. Um, great. Yeah. 
Well, so, uh, Loida, do you have another song for us? Absolutely. What is it? This is called Impondo. What does that mean? Impondo is a Southern African rhythm. Mm-hmm. And uh, this song is about the dance of love. And just imagine two dancers dancing to the Impondo rhythm. And more specific, this is the complicated dance of love. Oh, yes. How is it complicated? The ups and downs, the oh, back I and see. forth. I see. Yeah, so. Is this one of Mongezi's uh, South African beats? Yes, Impondo is in the belly. Gosa. Yes. Did you hear me? Gosa. Gosa. She did it. Yeah, it's she good, right? It. Gosa. She did it. I practiced for a long time on that. <laughs> <laughs> is over he takes his hand away from her and dusts his shoulder and dusts his shoulder curses the day that he paid to play now he is colder he is colder and now the winter fades spring melts the ice brigades as love grows bolder as love grows bolder every day his heart is tired his pain he longs for her every day, every day His heart is tired, his pain expires As he longs for her every day Or oh, in Pondo, or oh, in Pondo shoulder curses the day that he paid to play now he is colder he is colder now the winter fades spring melts the ice brigades as love grows bolder as love grows bolder every day his heart is tired his pain expires as he longs for her every day every day his heart is tired his pain expires as he longs for her every day. Or oh, in Pondo, or oh, in Pondo, or oh, in Pondo, or oh, in Pondo. his shoulder and does his shoulder curses the day that he paid to play now he is colder he is colder and now the winter fades spring melts the ice brigades as love grows bolder as love grows bolder every day his heart is tired his pain expires as he longs for her every day
Mpondo. That is beautiful. Thanks. It's you. really refreshing to see a female vocal artist in a true sense of the word. There are I found that it's difficult to find female African vocalists in plenty. It's always it's always men touring, men on stage, <laughs> maybe beautiful <laughs> girls in the background right, right. shaking and doing beautiful background vocals, but I'm just so happy that you're here and you're representing with your beautiful voice. Thank it's you. It's really nice. I'm proud to be here. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So tell me um, more about your album. Okay, well, so as I mentioned earlier, it's 10 songs. Mm -hmm. And the, the album is a dedication, I would say, to the process that it took for me to get to making the album. I've been mm -hmm. performing professionally for about 15 years. And this is my first full-length, strictly um, original album. And so that's in time is a is a snapshot of that process. But then it's also about my journey as an individual. I've got a little bit of everything that are the pieces of me in this album. Mm -hmm. um, I am an immigrant advocate, so I have a lot of music in the album about the journey that immigrants make um, from home to wherever mm -hmm. um, seeking a better life. And so I've got music about that. Mm -hmm. I've got a music that uh, I've got a song that's an ode to my parents and their journey from their corners of the globe and how they met and how they forged a future for themselves, whether it was on the continent, Africa, Europe, and then eventually America. And then there's music about love, mm -hmm. the loss of it, the process of falling in love. Mm -hmm. um, and there's also um, music about loss, like the one that we um, shared earlier in time and the healing process, and also one that's going to be, um, we're going to sing in a minute as well, um, which is called One Day. Mm -hmm. And One Day in particular is an ode to my religious and Christian background. And for those of us that do believe in a higher power, this song um, one day is about how um, folks that we've lost on this earth will get a chance to see them again one day. That's always a nice thought. Yeah. yeah. Well, let's hear it. Why not? Mm -hmm. home. One day my restless soul will no longer roam. One day tears will dry. Mamas won't cry. Babies won't die. I'm gonna fly all the way home. Far away from the pain. Far away from the shame. No more dancing in the He's coming back to take us home One day my restless soul will no longer go One day, Sunday, he's coming back to take us home My restless soul will no longer go Far away from the pain Far away from the shame No more hiding my tears in the rain Shame. No more hiding my tears in the rain One day, someday, my restless soul will no longer roam One day, I'm going all the way home One day, someday, he's coming back to take us home To take us all the way home
take us home One day my restless soul will no longer roam One day mamas won't cry, babies won't die I'm gonna fly, I'm gonna fly all the way home Far away from the pain, far away from the shame no more hiding my tears in the rain Far away from the pain Far away from the shame No more hiding my tears in the rain One day. Thanks, Loida. Thank you. This is Loida Georges. Um, African and American. Do you call yourself American as well? You've lived here, you grew up here? I guess I'm literally African American. You are? Literally. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Lloyd de Georges, a vocalist, jazz vocalist. I'm wondering about your vocal technique. It's really beautiful. Do you um, practice a lot or did you have formal training? I did have formal training mm -hmm. um, a long time ago. Yeah. To be sure, through. Um, elementary and high school mm -hmm. and my formal training was actually in classical music I can tell yeah 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 so how do you feel about that now do you think it was worth having it does has it defined you as a singer um so it helped me a lot through, whether it was sight reading controlling my breath um, just being more in tune with what I'm hearing and syncing it with the instruments that are playing around me not to say that someone that's not trained classically wouldn't have that those tools mm -hmm. but it helped me more in particular because I didn't have a musical background like I don't come from a family of griots I, mm -hmm. I don't come from a family of musicians mm -hmm. so this was a great way for me to fine-tune um, my talent yeah yeah so, so I'm you, grateful for it yeah and yeah. do you do you practice and stuff I do yeah um, now I do have a day job so I don't I'm not able to commit 100% of yeah. my um, time to music like a full-time musician would, but it's a craft that I really take um, seriously. Mm -hmm. And so when it's time to perform, I do make sure that I have got something to present yes. that I consider quality. I can tell. Yeah. Thank You're doing you. that right now. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Actually, that reminds me, years and years ago, we're talking 20 years ago, I saw Bobby McFerrin, the great American jazz vocalist, and uh, he was in, we were doing a workshop and somebody asked him, do you practice? And he goes, in the shower. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking, you know, wow, you know, you don't have to actually spend two hours a day as a vocalist. You know, you need to just do what you do and, uh, and it's okay. You know, yeah. Sometimes, if sometimes. you have if you have good pipes, you don't have to really work really really hard at it. Uh, you know, and then the other angle of it is if you're performing with other musicians, that's where practice that's true. really becomes critical. Yes, yes. I'm lucky that I'm surrounded by quality musicians where we don't have to have hours um, of rehearsal before we perform. Right. But the other end of it is they've been performing with me for a while, so you know we you we know had our other. hours of yeah. <laughs> Rehearsal anyway. So speaking yeah. of performers next to you, this guitar we were noticing this guitar yes, of Mongezi's. It's it is isn't beautiful. It? Um, Mongezi doesn't have a microphone. He did that on purpose because he said he didn't <laughs> want to talk today. <laughs> but um, can you tell us about this guitar? Sure, I may have to have him whisper in my ear what's going on. It's a Gibson Hummingbird. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. Sound. It's got a beautiful sound. And you it's borrowed it from somebody. Yes. It was lent to you. It's lent to me and, you know, for long, you know, it's a, what do you call the permanent loan. Long-term loan. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, I, I take care of it. You can see that, uh, you know, it's one of those that, it's a stable guitar. I mean, as a guitarist, you know, when you have one of these in your mm -hmm. hands, you know, that uh, it's a... Uh, Delicate details can't be missed. It's beautiful. Um, so can you play us just a little something, maybe something from your roots? <laughs> just a little riff here or there, yeah, maybe just for fun. We can do a... Baby Fe Dodo. This song actually was a lullaby my mother used to sing to me. Oh. And then it kind of morphed into a song. Oh, wow. Bebe fait dodo. En français? Oui. 
That's the annotated version. <laughs> <laughs> it's gorgeous. That's just beautiful, thank really. You. Well, thank you so much for coming in the studio. Thank you for having us. Lloyd de Georges. Thank you. And um, this is her new CD. Buy it. Please. <laughs> or listen to it. Is it on SoundCloud? It's on SoundCloud. Okay. It's on iTunes, Amazon, Google Play. That's, it's online. That's great. Yeah. So if you can't uh, afford to buy it, you can still listen to it and enjoy it. Absolutely. Spotify and Pandora, too. And the album has Mongezi on guitar in it, who yes. co-produced it, yep. co-wrote some of the songs, yep. the music. He composed, composed seven, the out mu- the seven, songs. seven out of the ten songs. Yeah. They're all originals. Wow, that's beautiful. Yeah. And Jordan's on bass? No, but he's on bass today. Oh, wow, well, yes, he is. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, but um, yeah. Okay, great. Yeah. So uh, thank you again. Is there a parting words? Any parting words you would like to say to African audiences or American audiences or whoever? Support good music. There are musicians all over the world that need your support. It's not just the big names, but it's the little folks that probably wouldn't get their time on air if it weren't for you. So um, find us online, like our music, and share it, and enjoy it. Will you say bye-bye in something beautiful and sensual in Portuguese? <laughs> I think that's like the most <laughs> sensual language I on agree. Earth. I agree. Até logo, mundo. <laughs> until, until next time, world. <laughs> this is Heather Maxwell for Music Time in Africa on The Voice of America.